Hello and welcome back everybody to day 30 of our Alpha 19 experimental series. My name is Lainey from Early Gaming and yesterday we worked a little bit on our home. Uh, I've just basically made holes all around the, the perimeter just so we could deal with zombies a little bit easier. And I've also upgraded some of the house just a bit more, uh, kind of getting us ready for the ultimate paint job that we're going to have to do over here. But I think today we're going to go do something quite special. Yesterday, uh, basically we flew around. We had a little bit of an incident with our uh, forgetfulness, okay? We forgot our auger. How could we? But we did. And uh, I think that ultimately turned out to be quite an entertaining journey. And today I had an idea of going uh, somewhere we haven't been before in the series, but somewhere that I love quite a bit. You know, it's definitely over here to Twin Genstown. So that's where we're going today. I'm gonna put my path over there. I'm pretty sure there is a church there and we haven't done that yet on this series and I am quite ready. It is super easy once you've done it a couple times and it's still early enough that I think it's a good idea to go do. We're here ready for liftoff once again. My favorite part of any game, flying. Oh, I can't even tell you. How many hours I've been putting into another game trying to learn how to fly. You guys might see the video very soon, but hopefully <laughs> if I ever finish it. But I'm going to go this way. We're going to get to our destination and we're going to slam some zombies out of that place. Now, I'm going to try not to be super cheesy about getting the loot. You can get the loot out of this place fairly simply without killing a single zombie. And I'll show you guys how, but I will do it the correct way, the right way, just for fun. Let's get to it. Perfect landing. And I knew that it was correct here. Very nice. Look at us go, guys. We're going to be so powerful. We're going to take on this whole church. All by ourselves. Where is it? <gasps> there it is. Mine. Okay. But we will take this whole church for ourselves. Now, this thing has given me a scare or two in the past. And if you didn't see, I think it was episode two or something of our Permadeath series, this place, it was... It was a stressful night, let's just say. But today, I think we're ready to take on this whole thing by ourselves. I think we're gonna do great. I believe that we can clear this in no time at all. And then maybe we can even go do the quest that she has given us over here. Uh, although I think it is a house that we've done before already, but it's fine, we can night loot it. But um, yeah, let's take our assault rifle that has been recently modded with our beautiful new mod. And let's get started. Okay, so the correct way is to go down the side here at the bottom. So that's what we're gonna do. And I'm pretty sure this floor breaks, as we already know. There he goes. And we're gonna take the stairs and deal with the zombies over here. Oh, you know what I realized? I didn't bring my junk turret. Oh, man. That's a lot of zombies. I think we'll be fine. Yeah, yeah, they, they're not running at me. There we go. We're doing great. And if you've never done this place before, there's quite a few books down here, or there should be. It looks a little bit bare right now, but usually there's a nice amount of books here, which I love to hit up early in the game. Yeah, I love finding book places early in the game, but we unfortunately didn't find this uh, early enough. Otherwise we would have ran it just to see what we could get. Because getting some knowledge early in the game so you can decide where you put your points, it's super important, I think. It's, it's one of my favorite things. If I find a cracker book, I'm doing it on day one. I don't care. It's going to take a bit. And it might it might be quite painful, but you can get it done. In fact, I, I, feel, I believe those places are a little bit easier earlier in the game because you don't get all the radiated and all that stuff. All right, out of that, we already got quite a bit of knowledge. We got the Automatic Weapons Handbook Volume 4. I can craft drum magazine mods. Oh, yes. Yes, that's going to be amazing. Uh, we might need to replace one of these, although I really like both of these. But we might have to replace one of these with the drum magazine. It's just too good. Um, hopefully we'll maybe get a level five tactical rifle and then we can do that. That might be a better better move there. Then we got the robotic turret schematic. Great, we already have one. 
shots to the legs with arrows or bolts slow your opponent. That's really nice. I, I really should use more arrows. It would save some ammo, but the club does the same. And then Hunter's Journal, Volume 6. Do 10% more damage to vultures. I will take that for sure. Now we go down into the catacombs over here, and this is where things might get a little bit rough. But let's just deal with the easy zombies first. Oh, we should probably turn on our light just in case. <gasps> Whoa! Don't scare me, lady. Excellent. And there's going to be a ton of stuff to loot here. Um, I could loot as I go. I suppose that would be the most efficient thing. I, I, I don't like to do that. I like to come back afterwards, but I think just because of how easy this is going to be, I believe we can get it done before nighttime, no matter what. And I only say easy because this bat is so broken. <laughs> it's just so overpowered. I don't know what to say. Oh, I miss when you could loot those. They removed it again. Remember how in one episode I said that you could loot the, the, the barrels, the wine barrels? I was so happy about that. I don't know why they had to remove it. I'm pretty sure that's universally hated as a, as a change. So, yeah, it's pretty disappointing, but it is what it is. I suppose they thought that they needed to. Oh, more loot. I'm just going to go drop off this at the vehicle really quickly because I'm already kind of full from all the items that we've gotten. And I don't want to have to worry about it later in the game, so... Hey! Can I make the jump? Oh, do I risk it? Yeah, we're going for it. Yes! Professional. Parkour. Even though I don't have parkour. <laughs> I don't know if I would have made it with parkour. Alright, well, let's get this done. In a row, that was crazy. Yeah, this is usually the difficult room. I'm just saying. This bat is broken. Oh, hello, zombie. And I think we left one other zombie out there that might be coming for us. Oh, why do I keep doing that? It's because I used to have my axe there. So I keep thinking that that's what I have to do, but it's not. It's not anymore. And I'm pretty sure that there is a zombie that I kind of let fall on the ground over here. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Goodbye. Yeah, it's, there's a biker dude somewhere here. Oh, uh, there's another guy there. Goodbye. All right. And here we are. I, I'm actually going to move my axe back here. Because apparently I have a, a weird obsession with turning that up. And uh, I've shot a couple times <laughs> when I didn't mean to. I don't know what's wrong with me. Okay. Um, as we all know, there's something wrong with me. But we just ignore it, you know, and uh, focus on the fun, which is destroying zombies one at a time. And now we're going to move up here. I could wrench. Did I even bring my wrench? I had it not. Okay, so I had a bit of a problem, okay? Because for Hortonite, I had so much stuff in my bags. So I started taking stuff out, and that's how I forgot my auger yesterday. So I started taking stuff out, kind of, you know, stuff that I wouldn't need for Hortonite, obviously. And um, I guess the wrench was also part of that. But I brought a couple of lockpicks, so let's give this a shot. Okay, so only two, not bad. Oh, yes. I mean, I already have it, but imagine if I would have gotten this not that long ago. That would have been crazy. I got this too, which I do already have. I'm going to, uh, I don't know if I should scrap it or if I should sell it. I suppose I want the parts uh, because hear me out. I was told, okay, from somebody that it can roll different stats. So we could even get a better level five one, which would be insane, which would be actually crazy. I probably should work on some sort of lucky looter or something at this point, just to make sure that I start getting some level six stuff. Because, um, obviously, that's where I'm at for upgrades. So, Bar Brawling Volume 2 is something we got. Uh, sprinting Power Attacks have a chance of knocking down your opponent. That is going to be nice. Uh, that's going to be really nice for a running Horde Knight if we do that. Um, Desert Wear. Okay, I can make that stuff easy enough. And let's go. On to the next. Now, this is uh, where I'm a little bit concerned. We're gonna we're gonna make it happen. 
Okay. These guys are not gonna defeat me. Not today. Not today. Just don't make me sick. Whatever you do. There we go. Oof. Uh, it's gonna fall, isn't it? Oh no. Okay. I'll pick it up, I suppose. I, I do need a few more crop lots. Although, I haven't even filled out the ones I have. But, you know, one day, I'll need them. So, there it is. And now I have to do this jump. It's gonna go well. There we go. Positive mental attitude succeeds again. And yes, I know I left one of the vultures, but I don't care, guys, okay? It's fine. I uh, can recover my stamina a little bit before we make this leap. Yeah, we're not cheesing it. We're not cheesing it, even though this is dumb to do this. We're not cheesing it. There we go. We made it. You just had to believe. We'll close that up just in case, since we know my track record with that kind of thing. And uh, here we are. This is the major loot room. It is quite nice, actually. It's got a weapons bag. It's got a med rip med station thingy here. Uh, I don't know if this is the same thing every time, if it's a med or sometimes it might be ammo or something like that. But you know, a little bundle. And then it's got a couple of boxes and it's got this big chest. Now, early game, obviously this big chest would be impossible to break without some lock picks. So just make sure that you do bring some lock picks. But you can, in fact, uh, get up here quite easily. Now, not that way, obviously. That's the danger zone if you do it this way. Just uh, need a hundred or so blocks and you'll probably make it up here with no problem. Just uh, be mindful that some of these things are not considered support. So you want to make the blocks all the way from the bottom and then just have all that uh, go all the way up without using these as your as your uh, kind of your support. Because if you do that, it will fall sometimes. As I know, as I have experienced many, many times in the past, uh, they do, they do indeed fall. I seem to have like, kind of a, a weird affinity for falling from high places. That's a little bit scary. Okay, so we got more. Oh, yes. Okay, that is some sick upgrade on the robotic sledge. All right, guys. Okay, okay. So I wanted to do the street fighter kind of base. I do want to do that. We're probably going to do it for this horde or for the next one, depending on how much time I have to get ready. But I want to make a base that a friend showed me. It's, uh, it's kind of an idea. Okay, that he had and I had thought about putting this turret in the kind of like the middle of our base which would work the same to be fair but his idea was cool because you can see more of the world and I've been kind of cooked up in this tiny little tunnel for the last three hordes and I, I need to I need to get out clearly as I experienced by last time so I'm going to go ahead and take all of that that is going to be a nice nice upgrade I can't even imagine that wouldn't be an upgrade all right but we got it we got it. That is sweet. Um, I'm not going to jump down like a crazy person. We're going to go down the proper way. Because uh, we don't want any broken legs today. At least, I hope. I'm just kidding. We're going to jump down. What am I saying? Safety? No, 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 no. No, no, no. What do you guys think? You thought I would be wise. You thought I would be sensible. Not today. Oh, hey. We didn't break our leg. <laughs> And uh, so I don't get punished for being crazy. That's good. That's good. For once, it succeeds. But we're going to make it to our vehicle here. We don't really have a plan other than to do that. That was that was the plan. And as you can see, it was quite easy. Yes, I have an OP bat. but Or a club, whatever you want to call it. But it is not a bad POI to do. It really isn't. The only big problem is that big room, but you don't have to go into it and just run up there like a crazy person like I did. You could you know, arrow them, and then they would die, you know, quietly, and you would be just fine. But let's put all our goods here. Got quite a bit of stuff. This thing is almost full, so that's always great. Uh, we can probably scrap some of this stuff. Obviously, we don't need all of it. We could sell some. I suppose we could go check out if Jen has anything good, although I doubt we're going to be able to make any money just out of this uh, to be able to be worth. But, I mean, I guess we might as well. We might as well. We're here. So we might as well check out the lady. <gasps> I see Lee. Okay, no, no, no. We're not starting this again. <laughs> no more roof camping, okay? I'm gonna be fine. I'm gonna play the game legitimately. Yes, I could have landed at the top of that church too. Don't get me wrong. I did think about it. But I feel like I you guys deserve a real... Okay, that is no go. That is a no go. Come on, bird. Come on, bird. All right, let's go. Let's go, friend. You and me. <laughs> Just me. Okay. 
So we're back. I'm gonna sell her only the, the books. I mean, I really don't feel like sorting out the, the other stuff, what I wanna keep or not. So let's go ahead and get so, in here. What are you buying today? Yeah, let's see. Okay, he has, she has tough guy glasses. I don't know if I have these to be, she has a hazmat. I don't know why I need this. Do I need this? No, I don't need it, but do I want it? Okay, fully automatic fire is more accurate with each shot fired. I have to buy that. Let's see if she has anything else. Oh, rocket launcher. Mm, I don't have enough money. She has night vision goggles too. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. She resets tomorrow. I don't think we can get here. I don't think we can get this stuff. It's okay. Night vision goggles are not that rare. Okay. On the I trader. I, I, I don't think they're that rare. So we'll be okay. We'll get them later. And let's go ahead and buy everything here. At this point, oh, I'm out of money again. Oh, this would have been wonderful for me. And they have three. It almost hurts that I left all my gold. Uh, maybe I have some something I can sell in the in the vehicle. Okay, okay, I do have some stuff. It's gonna be painful. I'm gonna sell some parts, but I think we need to do it just because I want them. Yeah. Stay safe out there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, but at least we can buy the stuff from the vending machine. So that's gonna be pretty nice, just in case. You know, let's get all this. I don't need the coffee. That's a little bit much. But we're gonna get all the candy. Excellent. And we got this book. That's actually pretty good. Uh, automatic weapons do more damage the more you shoot. Or accurately shoot, I suppose. Which, you know, might not do anything for me. But uh, it could do something for some other people. And I think, guys, now we have quite a bit of stuff over here. I, I don't know if I'm going to use any of these candies. The problem with the candies is that I would have to preemptively think about it. I would have to think about bringing it with me. And as you know, I don't plan things out too well. I'm going to go ahead and knock out this quest that she has over here. Uh, I know it's the same house that we've done a million times, so I'll just speed it up for you guys. But I figured if there's a chance that I can finish this before she closes, then we might actually be in really good shape. We'll get a little bit more money. I don't think we're going to be able to afford the night vision goggles, but we'll, we'll buy it later. I'm not concerned about it one bit. So here we go. We have done this before. It is not a difficult place, although it is bigger than it looks. But I'm going to rush through it at record speed. There was no way I was going to get gotten again. Uh, I think to clear the areas is done, I just need to retrieve the supplies because I, of course, didn't do it. But let's check the loot. Oh, at level three. Man, these are dropping considerably quick. And the robotic sledgehammer, uh, that I have been smelting. And honestly, guys, I've been getting some good stuff. Oh, a tier six of the spear. Sadly, it wasn't a better <laughs> weapon, uh, something that I actually use. The spear is my worst weapon. By far. I throw the thing around all the time. I lose it. It's a nightmare. I'm, I'm glad they did the thing where now you at least get, uh, I guess, like the little icon where it is. But I, honestly, guys, I'm still, I'm still super bad at it. Oh, let's get out of here. And I think there's a couple more boxes down here. I'm not going to loot too much. I just want to get back to Jen. Uh, we'll show you guys what I got. I say I'm not going to loot too much and then I end up stopping for everything. Yeah, that's me. Uh, yeah, why not? You know what? At this point, we're already on it. I, but I do want to get back to Jen, hopefully, before she closes today. I don't know if I'm going to make it. I hear the little puppy. Oh, man. We're going to have to kill... Oh. My goodness. You saw what I saw. Yes! <laughs> we did it. There's definitely a chicken in here. Oh, our daily chicken. It's back. It's back. My sweet gem. We got you. Okay, that's all that mattered. That's all that mattered. I actually didn't stop for the chicken. I stopped for this thing. But the chicken is a plus for sure. I was about to say, yeah, look, we might not get our daily chicken, but we got two animals today. That counts, right? No, no worries, guys. We got the daily chicken. We're fine. There's been a couple days here where we missed the chicken, but it was for good reason. We had no choice. 
but to uh, to follow a certain like a different path for ourselves. And uh, now it's back. All is well in the world. Oh no, it's not. Birds, why? That's never gonna happen. Okay, well, let's get out of here. I didn't actually realize Jen was so close. Oh man, so many zombies at her house. Don't worry, lady. I'll clean it up for you. Goodbye. Right click is the name of the game. And here we go. Please give me something good. I did. I did good work for you. I'll make the time. Here's your pay for a job well done. <laughs> okay. Well, I was happy about a level four, but I guess I'll take a level five. Stun baton schematic too, guys. I, that's that's good. That's good. No, no, no. Obviously, we're taking the robotic sledge. I mean, there's not even a question. Although I, b I believe it's the same damage as the other. I, I don't care. It gives you an extra mod. Even though I have no idea what you can mod in these things. But I know you can put the flaming one on it. It looks really cool. And we'll be able to see flaming zombies on Hort Night. So that's going to be great. Uh, and we have a couple more tier threes. Uh, they look close. So I'm a little concerned that they are where you think they are. Um, maybe yeah, this one. I always admire oh. the hard okay. work. Do hurry. We'll do another house. It's fine. Payment coming up soon. It's a different house. Okay, so that's something. All right, that's good, that's good. But I've leveled up and honestly, it's getting to be nighttime. And guys, I do have to work on my base. This base has to get finished before before anything terrible happens to this game. So I'm going to, I'm going to go back home. I have plenty of cement or I should be by the time I return that I can turn into more concrete and I have some concrete that I can use right now. So as much as that adventure was fun over here in Twin Gents Town, we have to head home. Now, I will stop and do this, uh, because why not, right? We might as well kill a few tourists. That's a real cracker book. Oh, guys. <laughs> so much for a night of upgrading, am I right? What is wrong with me? Oh, and there's a cracker book here, too. Another cracker book. A uh, cracker cafe or whatever it is. I don't know. Or working stiffs. I have no idea. Did I do these? There's no way I did these. Uh, okay, I'm gonna end up landing. No, 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 no. We're going home. We're going home. We'll come back for those. Now we know they're here, though. If I haven't done them, that's gonna be great. And if I have, then I'll come back here and we'll just quest for gen number two for Sister Gen a little bit. I think that would be fine. There's some stuff here we haven't done yet, like the fire station and other things. So I think it would be it would be okay either way. But it would be great if we get to do a full day of Crack a Book. Since there seems to be two right next to each other over there. Okay. This is going to be probably difficult. I don't know. I hope nothing from that house comes out. Uh, the chances are high, though. And these guys are going to be quite, quite the fun time. Okay, we're running a little bit. We're running, we're running. Reloading just in case, just in case. All right, well, that was not that bad. <laughs> it turns out that assault rifles are good. <laughs> just turns out that they're good for the game. Uh, there's a zombie trying to get out though. Ooh, a little bit of cement. Oh, okay, this was probably a, a bad idea. How is this harder than the the, the whole challenge? <laughs> one basement. Are we good? Yeah, there's a zombie trying to get in here, but that's fine. Let's just go ahead and grab this quickly. Oh, and these. Those are gold. Oh, what is out there? That is not a happy sound. Yep, that's a scary zombie. All right, it's fine. I'm just going to grab this toolbox. And, um, Let's just check it out really quickly. Anything else in here? Nope, we're gonna get out. We're out, we're out. You do you, zombie. Should I try to kill him? I mean, I suppose I, I can try. Well, I made it out anyway, so we're gonna have to. There we go. So many tourists. More than I thought. Easy, though. Okay. And now, we're going home. Perfect landing. <laughs> I love how Hope Cabin is only oak. New, new leaf. Hope Cabin now. 
It's fine. Uh, we have to get rid of all of this anyway. And I don't know if you were here for the last episode, guys, but I have decided to take down these metal ones because it costs more to upgrade the metal and then upgrade it to concrete than it would to just redo it completely from flagstone. That's how crazy it is. Um, maybe just because I have quite a bit of cobblestone, but I'm pretty sure, I, I'm not 100%, but there might be plates now on rebar as well. So that would even be easier. So that's what I'm gonna do tonight. I'm gonna start tearing this down and start replacing it with something strong, something that will hold, something that will stand the test of time. So, I mean, let's get started. Okay. I went ahead and added the points into Minor 69er and Mother Load. So now they're five out of five. Incredible. That is, that is great. And I've also added a point here in Sexual Tyrannosaurus. So we have the Cage Gladiator. We had quite a few points, guys. And uh, they've all been spent. <laughs> Unfortunately, I still can't make anything over bacon and eggs as a recipe. Uh, that has to change. Okay, I have to at least get some of this, maybe steak and potatoes. Vegetables too would be great. So my next point is definitely going to go into grandma over here. It's very appropriate, very fitting. But I am doing a little bit of work here on the mine. I have decided to make some blocks, kind of trying to give it some sort of stability. Um, these should probably all be upgraded to cobblestone. Plus, it'll give me a little bit of experience. I mean, why am I going to complain? But for now, I guess the staircase will be done out of wood. And the reason why I'm doing that is obvious. It's because it's cheap and I am broke. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and plop that in here. I'm just trying to make sure this thing doesn't cave in on me as I go. I've added a little bit of support there and probably should add more support somewhere over here. Uh, I, I think what would be wise would be to take this one all the way down as well, this pillar. And I think maybe we'll do that if I upgrade this. I have, I have plenty of cobblestone. Okay. Not a problem. It is morning time now, so I really shouldn't spend too much time doing this. But it shouldn't take me too long to just go up this thing here. Oh, no. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Oh, well. I can't be using concrete like that. I mean, it would be more safe, I suppose, if I did that. But I, it's not necessary. I'm pretty sure the flagstone will hold up the, the, the place no problem. Okay, there we go. Now we're out. We just need to do this last piece over here. You know, that got me thinking, though, if that does lead to where our mine usually comes from. So basically what happens here is that I go out this way. Okay. And if I turn, I believe it's left here, then I go down and then I can make my way to my home. But if we were able to dig this enough that we have a huge pit in here and we can just walk that way. <laughs> it's gonna be great since we know the path is right there. That is cool. That is really cool. But I, I was getting a little bit done here. I was getting a little bit mined. Uh, we got a nice amount of nitrate, decent amount of iron, not too too shabs, and almost a stack of stone. Guys, I think that's gonna be it for for today though. I don't wanna I don't wanna spend all day here. But let me show you the path back, just so you know what the madness is. Oh, this was not the right one. You know what? I should block this one because it's, it's it always confuses me. It's a goodbye. Good riddance, Bath. I will never think of you again. There we go. There's no way I will ever think that's the way in. It's this one. And maybe we even want to plug in the way to the old home. Because I left that there, but it's a little bit dangerous. And honestly, um, I will just go ahead and do it with the, with the normal block. So I also don't go that way. But this is the way. Okay. And uh, we jump down and we go all the way down. And I've left this here as a sort of reminder, I suppose, to go up. There is a little bit of uh, coal there and other resources. That's pretty nice. And then we have this jagged way back home. Don't ask me why. Okay, I um, I made a mistake. Why is it only doing one side? What in the world? No, that has to be. It's a bug. It's, it's a bug. Okay, let's not think about that. But I, I somehow already made it cement, so we're just going to go ahead and do it. But... I um I think this was the original path, and it has been always kind of jaggedy, so it doesn't matter. But you can see how it would be cool if our staircase came down here. So if we were able to create this huge pit here, and the staircase got up to there somehow, and then we can even put a little ladder so then we don't have to go all the way out there and then up and then through that weird corridor that I had to make because I kind of aimed wrong. So this would be the right aim. This would be perfect. This would lead us straight into our mind. 
You know what? I, I really want to do that. Should I do it now, though? Oh, is it worth it? Is it worth it? Yeah, it's worth it. It's worth it. I'm doing it. So I'm just going to do something really quickly right now. I'm going to do the ladder just because I will forget for the next one. I just know I will. And I don't think it'll be higher than 20. So we're going to go ahead and make those. Yeah. Yeah, I've gone crazy again. Here I go. Okay. There we have it. We've made it. Oh, it's so weird. <laughs> okay, we're having some issues here, but it's fine. Excellent, guys. And now we don't have to go down that weird path again. That weird side path. And I have no idea what goes down this way. I think it was just me trying to find more resources, which I think I found a couple, but I'm not sure exactly how many. And we're going to upgrade this just quickly into something. And we'll upgrade here, too. Honestly, I don't need that. Great. So this is going to look funky, but it's fine. It's fine. We obviously have some bugs going on, but it's experimental. We'll just let it we'll just let it happen. And now I don't ever have to go down that way, which is great. It's going to cut down my my little walk quite a bit. So it's going to be it's going to be pretty good. Yeah, this uh, this path is the most OCG triggering path I've ever done, but it is what it is. And now we're back home. No, no. No, 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 no. Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? <gasps> she broke in. She broke in. Oh, no. How is she in? She spawned in here. She had to have spawned in here. Okay. So, guys, this happens. Okay. This happens. Um, I had a big base like this. This is the problem with the big bases. Oh, she screamed. Okay. Well, let's have a little bit of water. Get ready because uh, we're going to have to fight this. Come on, boys. Please, just do what I ask and come down this path. That's all I ask. That's all I ask. Okay. Very good. You're at this window. Okay. We'll come meet you. No problem. And there's another one inside. Oh, no. They did break in. Look at this. Oh, this is savage. Yeah, we, we need to work on our base. <laughs> it's clear. But unfortunately, I can't really do that on the next one. Uh, we'll go ahead and put another one here just to cover it up. I will scrap that because I don't need it. Okay. Perfect. Uh, let's do this one. Copy rotation. Bloop. And they did break through one of the openings, so that's good. At least we know that for sure is working. Their AI is not broken. So that's something. But uh, yes, we do need to work on this base. But guys, I needed that metal. I needed that stone to get more concrete going. So I unfortunately can't work on it today. We'll probably do a little bit of looting during the day. Maybe we'll try to do a little bit of light looting. Uh, just to give some time. To this to get to get fully ready but yeah obviously we're not going to be able to do um all the upgrades today it's just we don't have the materials so slowly but surely we'll get it done we do need to make sure that we make it back home for a night time so that we can mine because if if every night we're mining at least a stack of stone we'll be ready in a couple days so i just wanted to thank you guys so much for watching this episode i hope you enjoyed our adventure at the cathedral i love going to that place it's always so profitable and it's uh, you you can cheese it as well if you so wish but thanks so much for watching and i hope to see you guys in the next one until then bye